The difference between 480p, 720p, 1080p, and 4K comes down to the number of pixels, and consequently, the resolution. But this isn't just about the numbers, it's also about human perception. 480p is considered standard definition. It's what we all used to squat in front of when Saturday morning cartoons were a thing. Jump up to 720p, and you've got high definition. Things are suddenly looking sharper, like when you clean your glasses for the first time in a month. Then there's 1080p, full high definition. Now we're cooking with peanut oil. The clarity of the image here is noticeably smoother than 720p, especially on larger screens. This is because there are more pixels per inch, which means details are finer, and the picture is more lifelike. But when we move from 1080p to 4K, things get a bit murkier. 4K is ultra high definition, with an awesome amount of pixels. But here's the kicker. The improvement isn't as jaw-dropping to our human eyes, especially as the screen size remains constant. Why is this? Well, there's this thing called the law of diminishing returns. It basically means that once you hit a certain point, the amount of gain you get for your effort, or in this case technology, starts to dwindle. When television went from kind of fuzzy to, wow, I can see the blades of grass as resolution improved, it was groundbreaking. But our eyeballs have a limit to what they can perceive at a distance most of us sit from the TV. 4K resolution is incredibly dense, and to truly appreciate the difference over 1080p, you need a larger screen, or you'd have to sit closer, neither of which is necessarily practical. The pixel density at 4K means we are reaching the limits of what our average eyesight can distinguish from a typical living room setup in Portland. Another piece of the puzzle is content availability and the source quality. Not everything is shot or available in 4K, and if it is, you better have the internet bandwidth to stream it without your ISP laughing at you. So, while technophiles and videophiles can certainly tell the difference and appreciate 4K, many of us might just be perfectly content with 1080p. After all, it's still high-definition clarity that would make the 480p crowd's heads spin, and there's something to be said for that.